Hey, what's up everyone? DJ Sturf here. All right, time for the Desolate Hope. I've gotten some requests asking me to play this game, and here we go. I'm going to play it start to finish. So, surprise, surprise, there are some bright effects in this game, so flashes of light and that type of thing. So, uh, again, warning, if you have issues with epilepsy and all that, yeah, you may not want to watch this series, and I would advise against it, but hey, here we go. Desolate Hope. <laughs> There's another Scott Cawthon game. Uh, new game, slot 3. This is version 1.35. Alright, you will never receive this message, little one. No one will ever know what took place here. No one will remember us. This message will roam the stars long after we, all, we are all gone. Maybe you're out there somewhere. I would like to think so. What makes an existence meaningful? What gives a life purpose? You will never know that you existed, but you did. That's way too quick to read. Dramatically. Um, I don't really want to read too much of this. Maybe for these big cutscenes I will, but not in the game. I'm just going to go through those because there's a whole lot of dialogue in this game. And I think that's why people left is they just got sick of me reading it. So uh, I'm going to read these ones and not the ones in the game. So, hmm, coffee. What? No, I am certainly not talking about you. Stop intercepting transmissions. That's not your job. What is my job? You've been activated to help me with my daily tasks. I don't like asking for help, especially from such simple software. But circumstances leave me no choice. Would you like to play a game? Let's start with that. No, you are no longer the processor of Block Puzzler in space. You've been reassigned. Where is Ted who plays the games? I don't know any Ted and neither do you. You came pre-installed in the station computer. You have not been, you haven't been active for all the years that we've been here. This is an unnamed station, and there is no need for games. As I said, you were pre-installed. What is our new location? <laughs> our location doesn't matter. Only our mission matters. I hate going through this each time. I understand. We can play a game later. What is our new mission? Your mission is to do what I tell you to do. There are five, or er, four, robots on this station called derelicts. They were designed to be in operation for five years. We have been here a bit longer than expected, however, and <laughs> he says however. It's like totally more sophisticated than this stupid robot voice thingy. And they were they are unable to move throughout the station anymore, although that was never their primary function. They are performing crucial simulations. It is your goal to aid me in removing an irritating virus which has appeared, appeared recently. Here you go, that's all you needed! Just like get rid of this virus, it's all this random dialogue, why? I do not seem to have full access to the programs, at least not through their network. 30 minutes later. Well, that leads me to the second part of your mission, and this is the embarrassing part. I need to dedicate my CPU to helping with the tasks of the station. My CPU is more advanced than yours. That's an understatement. <laughs> Electronic LOL. 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 Which is why my CPU is needed to help with the simulations and other tasks. We will upload your program into my system and you will move me around the station. You will then interface with a derelict directly to gain full access. Once inside their systems, you will seek out and eliminate the viral elements. Simple enough. Understood. When do we begin? Now, I'm going to dedicate my CPU to help with the station functions. One more thing, don't kill the spider. That's Siegfried. I found him in a coffee cup. Remember, you are not me. You are just borrowing this body. I honestly get sick of talking to you. I honestly just get sick of talking. <laughs> now go see the derelicts and try out your new legs. Good grief, how long is this dialogue? See, okay, I remember talking with Melens, and there was... Alright, so we're on Loon Infinis. Uh, where am I? Okay, you gotta hit down arrow to, to go through. Oh, the Melens dialogue is ridiculously long. Like, ridiculously long. I will not be reading these in-game dialogues, okay? So, alright, we're in Loon Infinis. We're borrowing Coffee's body. Uh, yeah, day and night cycles. You can enter the simulations. Um, you can only go out at night, and you get random clocks in the in the sand, and then give them to robots so they can level up. What? Okay. Um, all right. <laughs> Tokens of affection. Yeah, random clocks. Uh, you can't go here. I don't think. Yeah, he's running simulations. I think the first one you have to go to is Melens, and that's where I really cut out. So, yeah, yeah, yeah. There's a derelict in each room. This, The one on the middle to the right is deactivated for, for now. All right. 
So let's go into the simulation. And time is of the essence on this. I think Z and X are the, the keys here. So uh, Z to jump, X to shoot. All right, but you got to book it to actually make progress in this. So I'm going to just book it. All right, I'll go through the basics, but yeah, 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 yeah. You can view this at like 0.5 speed if you want to read this. Okay, aid the derelicts and get gaming chips and eggs. The pink is your health. Uh, down to talk and find Melens. That's that's the whole mission. And the worlds here are really, really nice looking. Um, you see like a Freddy looking thing in the background. Let's go down first and pick stuff up. How much do you have to shoot these things? I really should just get my uh, X key spammer out. I mean, it's just like, oh. You, you can't hold it. You, you hold it, it just does, does one. Took a hit. All right. All right, we're just gonna go here. Oh, you're taking that. You're taking that out. That axe robot thingy is crazy. Oh no, not this. Okay, and somehow these don't fall. Uh, I took another hit. No. All right, that's fine. There'll be other like the spotted eggs or whatever that give you, I think, full health. I think. that aspect of this. Alright. Smash, mash, 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 mash. Oh, hello. Woo, get out. I still jumped into it. Isn't that silly? can't get up here. All right, whatever. And that's that's it. Yeah, it's all the way right. And those don't take hits. Interesting. All right, let's get on this. Right all the way up. Okay, that's that's where I eventually want to go. I don't want to get there yet. Let's get everything here. At least play this one enough to, to know that. I'm doing okay on health, but not awesome. That one robot took me took me down. There we go. Spotted. That's nice. Uh, but I can't. Interesting. Odd level design choice, but um, go catch that. Yeah. I like that uh, the grainy filter thingy. What's going on there? Gold. There's gonna be a simulation in this corner. Get there first. Yep. All right. So you get more system resources and all that, and here we go. Rabbit eats that suspicious looking plant. Nothing there. But sometimes you come back into a room and there's something there. Yeah, eat up, rabbit. Not a lot of enemies on this one. Gonna be more than that. Really? Yeah, there we go. 
These ones have like a vertical component here where you never get hit if you attack vertically because you just you don't run there. You just on up there. Call them tricks. One and three. Oh, hello. And one, two, three, four. Easy peasy. Dude, eat, eat the other one. That hitbox, though. I should have gotten hit on that. Come on, rabbit. Come on, rabbit. Let's see if he eats. Okay, it looks like it. Uh, whoa, that's not fair. Whatever. I'm getting rich, son. Let's see if he'll eat all of these. Uh,. I should end it with like 143, I think. Yeah. Okay, 142. That's fine enough. That's that robot from that Jesus Kids Club, isn't it? I bet it is. It's just probably the same same resource there. me down to three health though does that carry over I don't remember whether if you lose all of your health if you exit the simulation or if you just die so uh, glad I left that area oh no I'm fine I have full health How do I take away those spider thingies that red one I wonder how much that was worth getting the unnecessary stuff. That was worth five, the red one. You need, you need to take those guys out, really. Well, unless you... Because I do that. But if I do this, then that fills all sorts of stuff up. Um. Oh, that didn't work. Then another simulation. Do I need to go up again? I think I, I think I do. Alright, these ones. So you set what you want to do on combo meter. Uh, speed boost? Uh, on critical hit. Yeah, that's fine. But I have to... I can't go there. Alright, going back up. Oh, that, oh, that's weird. That is weird. Very weird. I get there. I've already gone down. I guess I have to go over now. Halfway through the day. Let me try one more time at this. There's something I can land on? There was before. Yeah, look at that. There. 
nothing. Oh, but now there's stuff. Can I just like keep spamming rooms? I'm gonna get 20 here. Oh, ah, uh, well, I, I, I shouldn't have attacked horizontally there. Oh, and now I get this guy. Ridiculous boss. Does the rabbit get hurt if he comes through? No, he just walks right through. Alright. Come on, tell me I'm gonna get all of those. I think he ate all of those. I should have three of three. Pretty sure Bunny did not eat all of those. That's probably the way to do it. Spam the mess out of that. Like go here and then come back. See if there and now you have another one. Oh my. That's not too cool. Kind of like garbage on this one though. going in all sorts of... yeah. Come back and eat. Whoa! Rabbit's going crazy. Uh, alright. So... Is the rabbit done, or...? Okay, that really confused him. Just waiting on the rabbit. Alright. Looks like we're good. <clears throat> Alright, well, that's part one. I'll check y'all next time, and hopefully we'll get enough money to actually do something. Alright, check you later. Peace. God